Okay. Where to start? Oh my. My name? It's Ethan. Ethan Winters. Hello, Ethan. It's been three years since everything happened at the Baker House. I was looking for my wife, who disappeared. I got an email from her. She told me to come get her. And of course, that's how I ended up in the middle of nowhere, Louisiana. Of course. Always in the middle of nowhere. I found Mia being held captive in a dark basement. Fuck basements. She wasn't thinking right. Oh, that's that's how you she call it. She attacked me like some kind of wild animal. I remember Later on, this. I found out that she was infected by a special kind of mold. I looked all over the house trying to find an antidote, a vaccine, anything. The people who lived there were already infected. What was left of them wasn't human. Mm. The source of the infection was a bioweapon that looked like a little girl. Her name was Evelyn. I fought the fucked up family and was able to treat Mia's symptoms with a serum. Ew, what the fuck is that? Then Chris Redfield and his soldier buddy showed up and saved the both of us. Good. Is that enough? I really don't want to talk about what happened anymore. Hmm. It's all over now. Okay. This is Lover of Ladies, and you are watching the first episode of Resident Evil Village. Honestly. Why am I playing this game? Good question. Well, I have a boss who is one of my followers, and he told me that he would specifically follow my channel if I played this game. Now, mind you, I hate scary games with a passion. I am such a scaredy cat that... I was trying to watch the Insidious movie in daylight, and I couldn't finish it because that's how scared I got. So imagine playing a Resident Evil game. So expect a lot of screaming, shouting, because I'm simply just a scary, scary little cat. So shout out to Chris for recommending me this game. He says I'll be terrified, and yeah. I'm doing it for the views. That's that's why I'm playing this game. I'm doing it for the views. So let's start. Oh lord. All right. Um now we're going to do casual because I'm a noob. And yes, I I definitely need somewhat of an easy game, so Oh, that's cute. I like the little design Long of ago. it. A young girl went with her mother to pick berries for her father, who was hard at work. But the forest greeted them with a dark, cold silence, the bushes empty. Yet determined to find the berries, the rascal broke free from mother's grasp and vanished into the trees. Mother's worried cries faded fast as the girl ran on, over vine and under branch, and into the forest deep. Feeling strange eyes upon her, the girl recalled mother's scary bedtime tales, and her throat became bone dry. Ooh, then no the way. Then the lord appeared. He greeted her warmly and bit his own wing. Come, child, quench your thirst, he said. Ew. So she drank the thick, dark blood and smiled with joy. Passing through the graveyard, menacing storm clouds loomed, and the air turned bitingly cold. The girl was shivering in her thin clothes. Then a dark weaver appeared, and with a click of his fingers, crafted mist into a beautiful dress. Come, child, warm yourself, he coaxed. So she clothed herself and smiled with joy. Across waters deep and ominous she went, hoping a boat she found would carry her home. 
but hunger's grip tightened and her heart grew heavy. Whoa. Then the fish king appeared and offered one of his many fins. Come, child, eat your fill. So the girl ate and smiled with joy once more. Continuing on, she soon entered the forest's dark heart. Then an iron steed appeared, bearing a beautiful golden gear. The creature said nothing as the girl approached and snatched what she thought was another gift. The horse grew angry and summoned the other monsters. Terror filled the girl's heart as the wild wind rose around the beasts. Suddenly, a witch appeared, dark yet regal. Gifts we gave, but more you took, she snarled. So more in turn is due. Hmm. In a blink, the girl was trapped inside a mirror. Aww, look at that there. cute little baby. She's asleep. What is with the creepy story? She's only six months old. Woman at the store said it was traditional. <laughs> a local tale. Besides... Oh, wow. Rose doesn't seem to mind. She's gonna grow because up as a horror fan. It. Thank God. We moved here so that she wouldn't have to deal with any of that, remember? There's nothing wrong with my memory. Damn. You're just being paranoid. It's not... Never mind. I'm sorry. But I'm not paranoid. I'm just cautious. Then, go cautiously take your daughter to bed. I'll finish dinner. Aww. Ethan, look at you being a dad to a baby girl. I'm so happy for you, man. It's okay, Rose. Your mother doesn't want to remember him. I can't blame her. Okay, so... Did you say something? Nothing. Nothing. I'll put her down. Yeah, don't say anything, Ethan. You know how it is. Happy wife, happy life. Anyways... Wow, you got a nice good place over here, buddy. This is dope. You got a lot of rugs, though. Like, why do you need all these rugs? Alright, so where am I going? Huh. I mean, in all honesty, the details are amazing. I really feel like I could, like, touch that couch and touch that chair like and the indents and everything wow this game's good she's going to grow beautiful man this is nice once things warm up we can go for a walk huh okay beautiful all right let me put her to bed Aw, oh, Bendito. It's okay, baby. There, there. It's, it's like I said okay. to your mom. That book's too scary for you. Yeah, that book was pretty insane. Like, I really want to know what happened to that lower girl, but... That's... Ah, oh, this is the bathroom! Man, you have a nicer bathroom than I have. I'm so jealous. Like, that is so nice. Okay, I'm going to try and Almost find there, her honey. bedroom. Okay. This is... Wow, she has a really big room. Oh, okay, so the baby's sleeping with you guys. Okay, not bad. Alright, here's your kuna. There you go, sweetheart. Don't you worry. I'll be right downstairs. Daddy won't let those weird fairy tale monsters get you. That baby's living life, being fed, being able to poop on herself, sleeping all day. Shit, I wish I had that life. Ah, good looks. February 6, 2021. Maya and I had another fight. I accidentally mentioned what happened three years ago and she blew up on me. Seems like she definitely has PDST at this point. 
We finally settled down in our new life in Europe and can bring Rose up properly. But I still feel like a part of me is trapped in the hellhole back in Louisiana. I know Mia doesn't like to talk about it, but can we really just forget everything and pretend it didn't happen? Yeah, it sounds like you guys really need therapy if it's slowly getting that bad. Shouldn't we face what happened there so we can live our lives with Rose without it hanging over our heads? We owe her that much at least. Yes, Ethan, I agree. Break that trauma because you don't want that to pass over to your kid. I know Mia knows this too. She wouldn't have exploded like that at the hospital if she didn't care. Bendito. Oh, that's your stereo? That's pretty cool. So you guys are in Europe. That's cool. It's not paranoia if they're really out to get you. Oh, look at that. <laughs> the photo album. Wow, they basically live a nice life so far. Regardless of what happened back I in Louisiana. Could stay like this forever. Yeah, I know. Before you know it, she grows up, has a boyfriend, piercings. Daddy, I want a car. And you know what that means. Your life ins your car insurance goes up. But anyways, yeah, this place is pretty nice. This is a really nice house, Ethan. Like, how much is your mortgage at this point? Because your realtor really hooked you up. <coughs> Gotta do a deep clean before Rose starts walking around. Curtain closes on the Duvi gas incident. The committee completed their investigation on the 18th into the Dovi toxic gas leak in Louisiana in 2017. They concluded the deaths were caused by a leak of natural gas that had built up in the mud rock under the area. Jack Baker, 57, and his family, who were exposed to the gas, perched. Ethan Winters and his wife were also believed to be, have been nearby, but their current whereabouts are unknown. The entire area has been closed off by officials who believed it would be at least 10 years before that area is habitable again. Damn! That much toxic gas, huh? I've forgotten about this already. Yeah, that's what happens when it comes to disasters like that, so I'm not really surprised. Damn, the details are amazing in this game. I know it's a bitch to clean this place, but honestly, I wouldn't mind having it myself. Oh, I got the diapers in here and the wipies. This is so cute. Let me see what's for dinner. Uh, what is that? Okay, I mean, bread's good. I see jam. I don't know what's the rest though. Okay. Is she okay? Sleeping like a, uh, well, like a baby. Hmm, <laughs> that smells good. What's that? Oh, hands off, Mister. It's chorba de la gum. It's a local recipe. Wow, you've gone full native, haven't you? Mm. Local wine too. But if you're gonna keep sulking all evening. Maybe you shouldn't have any. Oh, come on, honey. Don't be like you that. You really have to stop worrying. It's just finding you in Louisiana, the pregnancy, Chris moving us here, military training, it all happened so fast, you know? Well, at least we're all together. Yeah, you, that's true. me, Rose. Now, everything's gonna Seriously, be- Seriously, think we can just forget about what happened in Louisiana? It happened so long ago. I just, I don't understand why you are so- What the fuck? Did you just get shot? Get down! Bro, you just got shot- No! What the fuck? And she's just standing there! She's literally just standing there getting shot! What the fuck's going on? 
Yo, what the fuck? What the fuck? Yo, Mia! Mia. Mia! Oh, God. Oh, shit. Who the fuck is that? Oh, what the fuck, bro? Chris? Who the fuck are what you? Wait, Sorry. that's Chris? No! Yo, what, what the Why? fuck, Chris? Who the- What? Why are you pointing guns at me for? Hey, yo. What the fuck? Why are you pushing me like that? Why you- Yo. I'll clear. Y you better not hurt that baby. What the hell are you doing with my daughter? Package secure, sir. Package? Take him away. I said what? get your hands off her! Ethan, no. No? What you mean? Oh, shit. Oh, lord. Who's... Get him off. There better be a really good explanation why you killed my wife, kidnapped my baby. Hey, yo. Hey, Doc. Hello, Mr. Winters. I got your daughter's results back, and I'd like you to come in to talk about that. How about next Thursday, 4 o'clock? No problem. We'll be there. That was the doc. She'll see us next week. Hey, now. Think positively, all right? We talked about this. I know. We hardly talk about anything else. Passive aggressive. I keep telling you, it's not Rose that I'm worried about. Well, then what are you worried about? Look, she's gonna be fine. I just know it. What else what matters? matters? We, we matter, matter Ethan. Ethan. You, you matter. matter. You just Mia. Won't. What are you what talking are you about? about? Is there something, Is there something you're not you're telling, telling me? me? Come on, talk, talk to, to me. me. How convenient. Yeah, I have to I take, have take this. this. Okay. Congrats, Ethan. You are alive. And... Jesus. A car crash? The fuck? Is that your cell phone? About damn time. What's your status? Is the package safe? What are you talking about? Where's Chris Redfield? And Rose? Who is this? This is a secure channel. You are not fucking around the Fuck. Hey, yo. What the hell happened to you? I don't know, Ethan. Let's go and check it out while I'm alone in the middle of nowhere. Fuck. Okay. Okay, so some dead person here. Mission objectives. Eliminate target. Re recover body. Secure Rosemary Winters and Ethan Winters. Move the two Winteruses to Site C for further investigation. At least two transport officers to accompany them. What the fuck? Oh lord, this is bullshit. So whoever was driving, you suck. Because now I'm in the middle of nowhere. Cold as shit. I mean, so far, this game is pretty interesting. I mean, I'm not scared yet, which is good. Oh, Lord, I can't even see for shit. Am I even going the right way? Oh, Lord, have mercy. I really, I really want to know why they killed my wife like that. Like... 
We were just having dinner. Like, I couldn't even eat my food. What the fuck? No. No, 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 no. Okay. Oh my god. Okay, okay, okay. No. I'm not gonna get scared. That's just a deer. It's a deer because I'm in the middle of the woods. Duh. I'm in the middle of the woods. Can't see shit. Wait, it says do not enter, and yet I'm gonna enter? Fucking stupid. This is some stupid shit you're doing, Ethan. And you got caught. Bro, it says do not enter. And I'm in- Oh my god, this is so stupid. I'm lost. Fuck them noises. Oh my god, my god, my god, What the fuck? What the fuck? Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. Here's the thing. I'm not playing at night. I'm actually playing in the daytime. And I'm starting to panic. That's how much of a scary cat I am. Oh my god. You know, these noises are not really helping. Can you stop? Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. So, no, something's in here. Something's in here. That's why that fucking gate said do not enter. Because some shit is in here. And I'm in here. Okay, that's cool. That's cool. Oh my god. What the fuck? Oh my god, there is an animal in here. There is a wild animal in here and I'm walking like the dumbass that I am without any protection. Oh my god, it's a fucking trail. Okay, it's a wolf. Yo, if I'm doing more for a werewolf, I'm gonna be mad. Like, where's my silver bullets? Where's Selena Kyle? I'm about to call her right now. She knows how to deal with this werewolf mess. I just thought of something. And it's just a theory. Ew! I walked into that- Nah, I'm not dealing with a werewolf because no werewolf is able to tie a fucking dead bird and leave it hanging like this. So what the fuck? Alright, my theory is scratched. Yo, what the fuck? Oh my god. Oh my god, I hate this. Like, I applaud the details, the sound effects is beautiful. But right now, I'm really- <laughs> Whoa, 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 Okay, can you stop? Okay, okay, okay. I hate- I hate this. I hate this. I hate this a lot. Hurry up. What the fuck? Oh my fucking god. This sucks. Okay, there's too many movements. Like, can y'all stop? Can y'all just let me just walk alone in peace? I hate this. Okay, a bridge. Cool. Finally, we're getting somewhere. This is the longest fucking walk I've ever had to do. Dead ass. Okay, tires. Garbage. 
The fuck? Where am I? <gasps> am I in the house? Hello? Hello? Was that a pig? Okay, that's cool. It's a pig. Can I move to another area, bro? No? Hello? Okay. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. Can I not close this fucking door? No? Cool. Oh my god, oh my god. Let me see what I can find here. Nothing? Well, I just wasted five seconds of my life. Oh, it doesn't even fucking work, but... Then again, f judging from what I'm seeing on that sink, I do not want that caca water. We had some drugs? Damn. You know what? I think I stumbled into a trap house. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm leaving, I'm leaving, I'm leaving, I'm leaving. Like... I'm leaving, cause I'm done. The fuck? There's nothing in here, Ethan. Anyways, I'm leaving. I'm- Oh my god. Oh my god. Am I making that noise? No, right? Oh my fucking god, this is so stupid. Um, excuse me? This game wants me to what? Go down the fucking basement? Oh my god, I'm going down the fucking basement. Ethan, why? Why am I going down the fucking basement? This is bullshit. Ew! Yo! Clearly you don't know how to clean after yourself and holy shit, I hate the noises here. Okay. Oh my god. Okay, so I know this place is smelling musty as fuck. I can tell. I can tell this place stinks. What the hell is this? Uh, rotate. Oh, cool. A picture of Jesus Christ. Why am I not surprised? Okay. Oh my god. Can you stop with the fucking noises? Oh my god. The fuck is that? Okay. You know, fuck these noises. Like, dead ass. <sighs> a fucking rat. Of course, it's a fucking rat. Cool. Whoa, 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 what the fuck? <laughs> so... I'm gonna stay right here because my Puerto Rican senses are telling me that whatever's up there can stay up there because I'm down here and I'm gonna stay down here. But you know what? If I do that, then I won't progress the game. Oh, wow! Okay. Alright, let's uh, keep it moving, I guess. Thank you for watching this episode. This is Lover of Ladies. Stay safe, take care, and I'll see you next time.